Oh, Dr. Shepard. Yes. I'm sorry about Danny Metcalf. It looked like it was hard on you, which is good. If I had a son going through that, I'd want the surgeon to be fully invested like you were. You have no idea who I am, do you? Of course I do. Huh. Bye, Dr. Shepard. You the nurse in OR2, the one that talked about clicks? Yep, right? 15. Hey, Rose. Rose. You know my name. I had to ask around, but now I know. Oh, good for you. Good night. Hang on. You know, I should have recognized you from the OR today. We worked together for three hours. And it's thoughtless. I've worked on 36 of your surgeries, and today was the first time you made eye contact. Like I said, hospital is no better than high school. Good night, Dr. Shepard. Someone figured out how to get back on the horse. What? No, no, no. It was just uh, talking about work. Could fool me. Hey, Dad, want to get a drink? <laughs> Oh, sorry. Dr. Shepard, I'm running behind today. I'll be out of your way in just a second. Well, actually, Rose, I'm early, so technically I'm in your way. Huh, well, in that case, don't let it happen again. You're staring at my chest. What? I think maybe you're intending to admire my ring, but it's coming off as you staring at my chest. Oh, sorry, it's just that, uh, you wear your engagement ring on your necklace. When I was engaged, I wore it on my finger. Now, yeah, necklace. The stone was my grandmother's. I don't want to lose it. Sorry. Sorry, why? About your engagement. Did you call it off recently? <laughs> well, that's a pretty personal question. Yeah, well, we're friends now. I mean, I saved you hours of potential licorice humiliation, so I think you can... It ended a year ago, and you have nothing to be sorry about. It was never going to work out. How come? Because I was always very clear about what I wanted, and he wasn't. And there's no way to build a future on that. Yeah. It's in. It's in? Wires in. Steve, are you still? Yes, sir, very still. Stop looking at me like I killed your patient. I am not a computer technician. I did my best. I gave it a shot. You didn't do your best. Yes, I did do my best. It was my best, damn it. Calm down. Take a deep breath and think. What did you miss? What are you forgetting? You forgot the restart button? I forgot to press the restart button. Yeah, working. It's working. It's working. It's working. <laughs> Santa Cruz is not just a party school. Oh, uh, Dr. Shepard. Yes. Um, sleeps. You saved her life. I uh, fixed her brain. Restored her motor skills. A highly stressful, extremely difficult procedure, but no, no. You saved your life. Man finds himself in trouble, which is most of the time. He turns to something bigger than himself, to love or fate or religion, to make sense of it all. Sweetheart? Do you ever eat anything that even remotely resembles real food? You'll have to take me to dinner to find out. You can't do that. That uh, kiss was unexpected. I like kissing you. I enjoyed kissing you, but I, I'm seeing somebody. Meredith Grey. Everybody knows about you and Meredith Grey. I have to see it through. I'm sorry. Don't be. It's just a kiss. See you in surgery, Dr. Shepard. Mm -hmm. but, but for a surgeon, the only thing that makes any kind of sense is... Dr. Mahoney, ER. Dr. Mahoney, ER. 
I heard about Dr. Bailing's son. How bad is it? We're still waiting on his studies. Derek. Hmm. Remember before when I was unbelievably cool and let you off the hook for making out with me? Well, now I'm angry. Why? Because you're not making eye contact with me. Because we are standing here talking about Bailey's baby and you won't look at me. Sorry. Better. Now, it was one kiss, okay? It was a good kiss. Maybe even a great one. But are we going to let one maybe great kiss get in the way of what up until now has been a really great professional relationship, even though you didn't know my name until recently? No, we are not. So, friends? Friends. Good. It's in the secret, the answer at the back of the book. Do you want to go to dinner with me tonight? I thought you weren't free. Turns out I am. And I'd like to go out with you tonight. Do you want to go out with me? That'd be nice. The chief needs to know who you've slept with by the end of the day. Be thorough. The chief needs to know who you slept with by the end of the day. Be thorough. This is no one's business. Ah, oh, it's the chief's business. So it's my business. I'm the chief's intern. What, what do they mean by sexual relations? There are levels of intimacy. Well, they don't need to know the... They just want to know the... Highest level. Okay, then. Um, I won't need one of these. You, you. Oh. <laughs> sure, okay. sure, I just don't know how to turn this back. I uh, think I'll take one of those after all. What? Why? <laughs> oh. Do you want me to get Christina? Derek is with Rose, and I'm okay. Derek is with Rose. No. I haven't said anything. I'm not talking to the nurses for you. You're dating my best friend. No. Come on, Rose, you're one of them. Tell them I'm a good guy. A good guy who happens to be mind-blowingly good at sex. Yeah, see, but that, all the talk about all the sex, is not what I think of as good guy behavior. Okay, the sex, I thought that was mind-blowing myself, but I get the impression that you had a really bad time. What? Why are you avoiding me? I'm sorry, I lost a patient. I'm not trying to avoid you. So not calling me after the sex is you being a dedicated lifesaver. It is. So I'll see you later. Are those best films? Yes, these are from two days ago and these are from today. Would you hand me the calipers, please? smaller than that one. The tumor's shrinking, the virus is working. Oh my God. <laughs> you have to go tell Derek. No, you have to tell Derek. It's the kind of news he'd want to hear from you. Rose, congratulations on your major medical breakthrough. It's the stuff of legends. 